Welcome back to Copper Star Precision, the channel dedicated to getting you more points at your competitive shooting matches. We're going over the October NRL 22 course of fire. This is stage four in the booklet called A Frightful Number of Targets. Luckily, unlike the cinder block stage where we're moving 10 times, this is 10 different targets, but it's one position, if you so choose. So the description is on the start signal, the shooter will take a position on any rung of the ladder and engage the targets from near to far, large to small. So 10 targets, and these targets, I'll put the target sizes up here, they're relatively small. These are uh, challenging targets, so don't feel bad about missing them. Luckily, it's not hit to move on. It's just hit or miss, move to the next target. Take your time, build a good stable position, and then just engage the targets. I had a dope card set up. I dialed for every single distance. There's two targets at each distance, so it should only be changing the dial four times. You have your first one preset and dial each way. Adjust the parallax. These are small targets. Try and make good impacts. Don't be discouraged if you don't make impacts. These are very unforgiving targets in terms of target sizes. I think the only way to do this is prone. I know a lot of other people maybe have problems with prone. If you have bad knees, if you can't get into a prone position, that's fine. We encounter our ladder stage very frequently, almost every month in the course of fire. You should know which rungs of the ladder suit you best. Maybe it's standing. Not as stable for me. I like two points of contact. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the bag at the front here. I could even substitute another bag. I don't have to have it on the plate. For me, it's just convenient. I'm gonna put the rifle down at the start of the stage. I have a large pump pillow here as rear support. I'm gonna get down on the rifle. I'm grabbing this to make my, the rear of the rifle supported. And then from here, it's just engaging the targets. I open up my left eye, even though the trigger cam is in the way, I can open up my left eye, I can look at my turret, I can click, I can click by feel. This uh, Bushnell, Bushnell Match Pro has very tactile clicks. So for example, the dope on my first was 0.3, so I'll be dialed for 0.3. I'll engage the two targets. Without even moving, I can just feel one, two, three to 0.6, which is my next one. I can count one, two, three, four, five to 1.1, which is my dope. I can always open my left eye and double check, but having those tactile clicks on your scope really helps. And it's just a simple matter of building a strong foundation and engaging those targets. Good breathing, good trigger pull, and you should be successful. But again, don't get discouraged. These are some very challenging targets. You will have enough time if you build a stable position to dial for each target and adjust parallax, but you have to make, you have to have an accurate gun, first of all, but you also have to make good fundamental choices in terms of trigger squeeze, breathing, because these are very unforgiving targets. Let's see how it worked out at the match. Are you ready? Ready. Yeah, the one-on-one 